Libras, this is your reading for January 2022. Let's jump in with each other and see what is going on for you guys. I hope all of you guys are doing well out there. You're happy, you're healthy, you're taking care of yourself. This is going to be a general reading for you guys. We're not going to apply any questions to this reading other than what message spirit has for you and what message your higher self has for you here, Libra. Okay. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Yes. Love that card. Okay, so beautiful things coming in towards you here, Libra. That's what I'm seeing. Your first card uh, is saying pushing upward here, okay? Growing, expanding, evolving. That's what I feel. Steady progress. That's what the universe want, wants you to focus on. Steady progress. They're letting you know that things are moving in the right direction. They want you to continue to uh, gain confidence, Um in yourself and your abilities and your intuition here um they're letting me know that you will soon receive recognition for the hard work that you have put in libra okay working very hard to grow um continue to appreciate all of the small things and big things that are happening in your life here okay clarifying this pushing up card you guys have uh, the strength card that is coming out as well okay so your card is saying you are far more powerful than you realize believe in yourself what seems impossible can be overcome with determination and the right skills do not give up you are almost there whatever happens you will gain wisdom from the experience here okay so that's just a message to you guys here okay your next card is saying small is beautiful here okay so like i said um appreciate the small things that are happening in your life okay and slow down and appreciate the small things okay um in your life as well appreciate um all the blessings appreciate nature appreciate the things that you have acquired uh, appreciate the lessons that you have learned here okay and pay attention to your heart that's what uh, they're letting me know here as well they want you to work on keeping things simple and if you do that you will experience victory so this card is coming out a lot for everyone here okay so they still want you to acknowledge uh, po possibly the, the difficult times that you have uh, had in your life uh, and appreciate those difficult moments here. You can bring encouragement to others uh, through that experience and become wiser in your uh, life through those experiences here as well. So they're saying congratulations on your victory through those difficulties. You have pursued goals to fruition here. So you guys have a lot of luck on your side. You have a lot of blessings that I feel are about to come into your life here, Libra. They're saying that this is fulfillment, completion, and arrival from a long journey here. Remain connected with your bigger mission in life and prepare to embark on your next adventure here, okay? Your next card is saying the taming power of the small. And they want you to focus on this little spider that's here, okay? This little bitty spider that is coming in on this, uh, on this picture, okay? Uh, building or creating that grand web okay um i feel like they're wanting you to um continue to prepare yourself for this new journey or this new the new blessings that are about to enter into your life okay the card is saying careful pre preparation here for something that is grand have patience in yourself slow down and appreciate everything every experience that you have had here okay you have inspiration that's coming in on this water let me if i can center it here on this water energy here inspiration you are encountering a burst of creative energy new passions and inspirations for life 
for what you desire here, okay, Libra? Take advantage of it. Feelings and sensations can be overwhelming at this time. Use this opportunity to manifest your desires, but maintain uh, maintain integrity and emotional intelligence here and don't let people take you out of character. <laughs> That's something else that I'm feeling here, okay? Um, there's this big focus here in the month of J January in um, self-sufficiency here, okay? And overcoming, I feel, minor impediments, um, minor slowdowns, okay? Or standstills, that's what I'm feeling here. You can manage those. I feel like they will be very temporary. If you feel like things are slowing down in your life, just know that spirit wants you to embrace um, your experiences at that time here. Okay? Yeah. So you guys are definitely growing. You have the Hierophant card, the Eight of Wands, and you also have the devil card that is coming in as well. So some of you guys, I feel there is fast movement away from things that may be very tempting towards you, that may not be healthy for you. There's this change of mind. There's this change of heart that's happening here in the month of January. You guys are dismissing or moving out of it of a uh, negative or stagnant energy here and i feel like you are releasing this devil energy here okay you, some of you guys are dealing with a capricorn that you're releasing here okay but i feel like you're uh, accepting challenges here and dealing with them up front here due to the wisdom that you have and that is kudos to you okay uh, for following your intuition, for following um, your heart here, okay, and uh, holding on to your your values here, okay, and bringing order and stability back into your life. A lot of you guys are focusing on your inner truths here, and that's why things are moving forward for you here in your life experiencing a lot of sudden changes that's what you guys are going to be faced with but those are positive changes that i feel like you guys are going to be faced with here okay um not negative ones it's not going to be a struggle here in the month of january even though you may feel an emotional struggle here just embrace that energy acknowledge it and continue to move forward um, and deal with those minor impediments that you may be faced with in life, okay? Don't let them overtake you, okay? So you have 88 that's coming in here. I feel like they're talking about growth, especially with the Eight of Pentacles, Eight of Wands, growth in areas of your life that you want control over. That could mean your career, business, relationship here. Not like you have total control over your relationship because uh, there's free will for everyone. But I feel like even in a relationship, you're going to have a meeting of the mind. There's going to be a lot of love and attention being shown here and a lot of forward movement with the Queen of Pen Queen of Wands and the Queen of Cups here. Okay, you're going to see you and your partner or even a new person coming into your life uh, wanting to work with you and be very uh, uh, successful in a relationship romantic or business here okay okay you guys have the taming power of the small that's coming in with the inspiration card you also have the five of pentacles the knight of wands that is clarifying this energy here so uh, i feel like this is you um, I told you that you're adapting to change here. That's what the energy feels like. You may be adapting to the things that you had to let go of, relationships, connections, uh, unfortunate events that may have happened in your life in the past here. You are uh, learning through those experiences here, uh, Libra, and learning to let go of that negative energy and vibration that you have been struggling with. Um, I definitely feel like there's this... Uh, this vibrant energy of you wanting to move past being sad, being alone, being held down, okay? Or feeling like you are uh, being held down. Uh, the Knight of Wands is making me uh, feel like this, like you have this new energy here where you are pushing through, 
okay? Like your card is saying, pushing upward here, pushing through any challenges or accepting those challenges here, which will bring in exactly what you are needing here, okay? So you're balancing your life very well here in the month of January. Good for you guys, okay? Making decisive decisions for yourself, Um and staying flexible in uh, the changes that may be happening uh, in your life here, okay? Three of Pentacles. So I feel like there is definitely a lot of blessings uh, coming into your life here, but it's not without struggle. Unfortunately here, okay? You have to go through a lot to get to this place here. So, um, but victory is on your side, okay? Victory is here for you, Libra. Let's see what your higher self wants you to know. <laughs> your higher self is saying you are hypnotic. You're hypnotic, love. Okay? Hypnotic. There is an intensity in your face like staring into a tiger's eyes. Primal energies with a whisper of chaos and passion producing a sense of excitement in others. This is how you are making others feel or this is how you're going to make them feel here. Okay, let's shuffle this again. What are the messages here from Libra's higher self? I definitely feel here, Libra, you guys may have a Aries, Leo, Sagittarius if you're single, okay? Um, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio coming into your life here that's going to be very hypnotized by you or all into your energy, um, all into your Venus energy. Um, <laughs> and I feel like they're going to be um, definitely inspired and fall in love with you quickly. Let me just be clear with you here. Okay. You have magnetism. Um, that's showing up for you here. Okay. Magnetism. Very beautiful card coming in. They're saying you have a natural ability to make others come after you. This is what I'm saying. Okay. Possessing a powerful aura that makes it difficult to stay away. You can use this. I'm not saying you this use this in a negative way. You guys, some of you guys can't help it. You're just coming into this energy where you're very hypnotic, and you're gonna have a lot of people gravitating towards your light, towards your energy here, Libra. Okay, uh, specifically a lover here. Okay, even in business, I feel like others will want to couple with you or work with you. Three of Pentacles that's showing up here, wanting to collaborate with you, be around you connect with you here okay so expect phone calls love interests um business offers here you being quite busy here this uh this month building uh your life up okay yeah in business and in love that's what i'm seeing here okay the past is going to be a distant memory those challenges that you may have been dealing with with past lovers here um is not going to phase what phase uh phase you anymore okay i feel like even if you're in a current relationship you're going to start to see your uh significant other wanting to be closer to you depending on you more relying on you more wanting to build with you um on a stronger level okay eight of pentacles someone that is not giving up that's going to ride the wave with you that wants to be with you here just know this okay you have the creature or creator what does that say creature that's coming in here you have the ability to shape shift into any animal or possibly having have a strong affinity towards them this can give you the strength wisdom and power of that specific animal here and under the deck you guys have unseen here coming in okay you have an invisible force to you libra an intangible quality impossible to describe very alluring in a non-obvious way keep them puzzled and curious to know 
more about you. What? Okay, so this is your embodying of that's why you're gonna be so damn victorious here, okay? Victory is yours, okay? That's what I'm feeling for you guys this month, Libra. All right, this is your reading. I love you guys. Take care of yourself. If you got a message out of this reading, make sure you give this video a thumbs up, hit that notification bell, subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't done so already, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care, Libra. Bye.